The Young and the Restless Spoilers Kyle Abbott sat in his office at Glassade, staring blankly at the papers in front of him. His hands trembled slightly as he held the document that had just been delivered to him, a termination notice. The official wording blurred in his vision, but the message was clear, Kyle Abbott, your services are no longer required. It was over. For months, Kyle had believed he was positioning himself as a key player in Victor Newman's grand plans. He had stolen Jabot's prized moisturizer formula, convinced that doing so would solidify his place in Victor's empire. Victor had dangled promises of power and influence, manipulating Kyle's ambitions and insecurities. Kyle had thought that by betraying his own family and delivering the formula, he would earn Victor's trust and be given more responsibilities, more opportunities. But now, all of that had crumbled in an instant. Victor Newman, as always, had been several steps ahead. The formula had been what he needed all along, not Kyle. With the secret of Jabot's groundbreaking moisturizer in his hands, Victor no longer had any use for Jack Abbott's son. Glassade would soon be launching their new skincare product, built on the very formula Kyle had stolen from his own family. And Kyle? He was just a pawn, easily discarded once his role was fulfilled. Kyle's mind raced with anger, humiliation, and regret. How could he have been so naive? He had truly believed that aligning with Victor was the path to power, that betraying Jack and Jabot was worth the risk. But now, he saw the truth with devastating clarity, Victor had never intended to keep him around. Kyle had served his purpose, and now he was being cast aside like an old, broken toy. The anger quickly turned into panic. What would he do now? He had severed ties with his father, Jack, and alienated himself from the Abbott family in his quest for success with Victor. He had jeopardized everything, and for what? A few fleeting moments of feeling important in Victor Newman's world? And now, his career at Glassade was over, his future in tatters. Worse still, he had handed Victor the very thing that could bring Jabot to its knees, a betrayal so deep that it might never be forgiven. As Kyle sat in silence, staring at the termination notice, memories of his conversations with Victor flooded his mind. He remembered how Victor had praised him, subtly feeding into his ego, making him believe that he was essential to the Newman Patriarch's plans. But it had all been a manipulation. Kyle had never been more than a means to an end. Victor had used him, plain and simple. Victor, on the other hand, was already moving forward with his plan. The formula Kyle had stolen from Jabot was now in the hands of Glassade's Randy team, and they were preparing to launch a new moisturizer line that would rival anything Jabot had to offer. For Victor, this was about more than just business, it was about crushing Jack Abbott once and for all. Victor had always viewed Jack as an adversary, someone he could manipulate and outsmart. Now, he had the upper hand, and with Glassade poised to take over the market, Jabot's days of dominance were numbered. Victor had no intention of keeping Kyle around. He saw the young Abbott as reckless, impulsive, and ultimately unfit for the serious work required to run a company like Glassade. Kyle had served his purpose by delivering the formula, but now that the real work was beginning, Victor wanted someone he could truly trust at the helm, someone like his wife, Nikki. She had always been a steady hand in the Newman Empire, and Victor knew that with her in charge, Glassade would be unstoppable. Victor's plan was simple, install Nikki as CEO of Glassade and push forward with the launch of the new moisturizer. Kyle was a liability now, and Victor had no room for liabilities in his empire. The termination letter had been the final nail in the coffin for Kyle's time at Glassade, and Victor didn't give it a second thought. Kyle's usefulness had expired, and now he would be left to pick up the pieces of his shattered career and reputation. Kyle's anger simmered as he replayed the events leading up to his firing. He had betrayed his family for nothing. He had been lured by the promise of power, only to be discarded when Victor no longer needed him. And now, he was paying the price for his ambition. Meanwhile, back at the Abbott mansion, Jack and Diane received the news of Kyle's firing with mixed emotions. Jack had always feared that Victor would use Kyle for his own gain, and now those fears had been realized. Kyle had played right into Victor's hands, and now Jabot was at risk. 
The moisturizer formula that Kyle had stolen was one of Jabot's most valuable assets, and now it was in the hands of their greatest competitor. Jack's anger was tempered by sadness, his son had betrayed him, but Kyle had also been manipulated by a master manipulator.